Hello, how to solve 8 power x plus 2 power x is equal to 222. To find the value of x from this equation. Now from 8 is same as 2 power of 3, then bracket power of x plus this 2 power x is equal to this 222. Then in next step from here, we'll apply exponential rule that a power of m bracket power of n is equal to a power of this and this is power of m n is equal to power of n inside the bracket power of m outside the bracket. So to be a power of n bracket power of m. Then in here, we'll exchange power of x inside the bracket power of 3 outside the bracket. So to be 2 power of x bracket power of 3, then plus this 2 power of x is equal to this 222. Then in next step, 2 power of x is common. So we let y is equal to 2 power of x. Then it will be y power of 3 plus y is equal to this 222. Then we take this to the left side. So it will be y power of 3 plus y. Then this to be minus 222 is equal to 0. Then we solve this cubic equation by factorization. Now from this 222 is equal to 37 times 6. Then from this y, y will be equal to from 37, it will be y is equal to 37y minus 36y. Then in next step, from our equation, it will be y power 3. Then y is same as negative 36y. Then plus 37y. Because this minus this is y. Then from this negative 222, is equal to 0. Then in next step, in here y is common. So we take y out of bracket, then this divided by this is y square, this divided by this is negative 36 bracket, then plus, in here 37 is common, so we take 37 out of bracket, this divided by this is y, then this divided by this is negative 6 bracket is equal to 0. Then in next step, our question will be y bracket this y square, then minus 36 is same as 6 square bracket, then plus this 37 bracket y minus 6 bracket is equal to 0. Then from here is in the form of a perfect square. So we'll apply the rule a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket then times a minus b bracket. So our equation will be y bracket y plus 6 bracket then times y minus 6 bracket then plus this 37 bracket y minus 6 bracket is equal to 0. Then in next step, here y minus 6 is common. So take y minus 6 out of bracket. Then this divided by this is this times this. So y bracket y plus 6 bracket. Then this divided by this is this. So it will be plus 37 bracket is equal to 0. Then from here, we have two solutions, where the first solution is y minus 6 is equal to 0. And the second solution is this, whereas y times y is y square, y times 6 is to be plus 6y, then plus 37 is equal to 0. To solve from the first solution, we take negative 6 to the right side. So it will be y is equal to 6. Then from here, we'll find the value of x. Now to solve from this quadratic equation, whereas a is equal to coefficient of y square is 1, and b is equal to coefficient of y is 6, and c is equal to 
constant is 37. Then from the determinant formula, determinant is equal to b square minus 4ac. Then determinant is equal to b square. It will be 6 square, which is 36. Then minus 4 times a, a is 1 times c, c is 37. Then determinant is equal to 36. Then minus 4 times 37. 4 times 7 is 28. 4 times 3 is 12 plus 2 is 14. Then it will be determinant is equal to this minus this to be negative. 8 minus 6 is 2. 4 minus 3 is 1. 1. Then because this is negative, which is less than 0, therefore from here there is no real solution. So, we'll continue to solve from the first solution where as y is equal to 6. But before, we let y is equal to 2 power x. Then, but, but then, y is equal to 2 power x. Then it will be 2 power x is equal to 6. To find the value of x, we'll apply log in both sides. So, it will be log of 2 power x is equal to log of 6. Then this power of x will move to the base. So it will be x log of 2 is equals to log of 6. 6 is same as 3 times 2. Then bracket. Then the next step we divide by log of 2 in both sides. So log of 2 will cancel with log of 2. Then it will be x is equal to log of 3 times 2 is same as log of 3 then plus log of 2 over log of 2 so we'll divide by log of 2 in both parts then x is equal to in here log of 2 will cancel by 1 and this by 1 so 1 over 1 is 1 plus log of 3 over log of 2 is same as log of 3 base of 2. So, this is the final answer for the value of x in this our problem, which is 1 plus log of 3 base of 2. Now, to check if the value of x is correct from this our problem, to check from the value of x is equal to 1 plus log, log of 3 base of 2. Then it will be x is equal to 1 plus log of 3 base of 2 is same as log of 3 over log of 2. Then it will be x is equal to 1 plus log of 3 in calculator is 0 0.4771 over log of 2 in the calculator is 0 0.301. Then it will be x is equal to 1 plus 0 0.4771 over 0 0.301 is 1.585. Then it will be x is equal to this plus this. It will be 2.585. Then we substitute this value of x, 2.585, into these powers of x. So to be 8 power of this, it will be 8 power of 2.5. 8, 5, then plus 2, which is this 2 power of x, whereas x is this. So it will be 2 power of 2.585 is it equal to this 222. Then from the calculator, 8 power of 2.585 is 216.0168. Zero one six eight then plus two power of two point five eight five is same as six point zero 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 two then is it equal to this two hundred and twenty two so when we add this two hundred and sixteen plus six is two hundred and twenty two then point zero one six eight point zero zero two to be point zero two 
which is approximately equal to this 222. So when we round off these decimals into ones, it will be 222 is equal to this 222. So if left side and right side are equal, then it is proved that the value of x which is 2.585 or 1 plus log of 3 base of 2 is correct. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.